Hey guys, what is up? And welcome to the third episode of the Chelsea's My City Prelude. So, yeah, we're going to get into matches this episode against Real Madrid and LA Galaxy. First match, obviously, is going to be a bit of a headliner. We are playing against Real Madrid. They won 3-1, I think, today, so a solid result for them. They're going to be a pain to play in the game. They're probably one of the best up there with uh, Barcelona. So yeah, we're going to stick to world class. Uh, I can't win on Legendary. Like, I have no chances there. Um, yeah, so unfortunately, uh, Cahill started in real life. And... Uh, I remember why I hate Cahill. Cahill, he's not a terrible defender. It's just his passing is so bad. Like, it makes Alonzo look terrible. The second we have Rudiger there, like... Alonzo looks like the best wing back in like, the world. And then Pedro, basically, Kale comes in and he looks like a spastic, so. Yeah, it's kind of irritating, and uh, hopefully Conte will see the light and uh, make a good change there. Regardless, uh, we're going to get into the match for Real Madrid. Obviously, there's the return of Alvaro Morata, so that's obviously uh, good. So I forgot to show uh, the Real Madrid squad. So it's a 4 3 3. Marcelo Ramos, Varan, Carvajal, Casemiro, Cruz, Modric. Ronaldo, Benzema, and Bale, and they have Isco, Asensio, Kovacic. Wow, they have an incredible bench. Uh, that's quite something, but yeah, let's get into the match. Have you a really nice time to have to have time? There we go, okay. Nil nil at the moment. Um, very close game. I think either side would deserve a uh, victory, so I am going to be taking off. I'm going to take off Pedro, though. Moses has been good in the wing back role, so he's going to come on, and then. Um, I think that's going to be it for the moment. Uh, I like the midfield presence that we have. presence But, uh... Definitely could use some improvement. Keep Chivo. I apologize for my defense being spastic. One of the first touches have been really lacking. Oh god, what is the passes? Like, what are up with them? Okay, there we go. That's something more interesting enough. Cesc Fabregas, oh! Oh, what a finish from the edge of the box! It's Cesc Fabregas in the 74th minute! Cesc does the business. What a finish from the outside of the box. Right off the post. No chance for the keeper. What a stunning hit there. Thought the play was over at that point, but Cesc with a brilliant first time finish. And what a goal it was indeed. No chance for the keeper. He got sort of close, but when he hit it that cleanly, it's it's never going to be prevented from going in. It's Willian! What a save by Sesk Minavas! And there we go! It's a narrow 1-0 victory! We have managed to pull off a narrow 1-0 victory over Real Madrid. I think we deserved it in the end, but... Um, uh, definitely a very tough game, and it's not going to be easy. However, uh, something that hopefully might be a little easier, we're going to be playing against uh, LA Galaxy, so hopefully we can be a little bit more up to snuff. So, they're a decent enough side, but they uh, kind of lack some of the superstars that they had in the past. So, let's take a look at their lineup, though, first of all. And they are running a 4-4-1-1. They have Giovanni Dos Santos, which is pretty much their main player. They have Alessandrini from France, um, yeah, oh, they have Ashley Cole still, wow, I didn't expect him to be there, um, anybody knows, well, nope, okay, yep, that is it, so a 4 4 one, one. Uh, Giovanni and Jonathan Dos Santos, I think, so, uh, they at least have a decent, uh, midfield connection, uh, and our lineup, obviously, is gonna be the same as usual, so, uh, Ashley Cole, actually, is one of the, f oh, at least Ashley Cole there, Obviously, he's one of the faces of the series, so kind of interesting to see him there. Yeah, regardless, um, going to go into our 3-4-3 as usual. Um, it works really well for us, so I see no reason to change it. Uh, Cahill, like I wish he had have had it to happen to him in real life, uh, drops to the bench in favor of Rudiger. But as you can tell, I love way more than Cahill. 
I am fine with Cahill, but when he starts against Arsenal and then we draw, uh, I'm not blaming him, but I'm just saying we would be able to move up the ball much better around the pitch without him in the defense. There we go. Uh, half time comes. Gonna make some changes earlier than normal. Um, been a really boring game, so I'm gonna make a double change on the rights. Actually, no. Okay. I'm gonna play Pedro as a right wing back. I'm gonna play Willian as that right mid. Back Yoko has been good so far, um, but. It's really going to be it in terms of changes, so. Only got half a game left, so let's make a good, solid impression. Okay. Says Fabregas! Says what a finish! What a finish by Sesc Fabregas there! Unbelievable! From the man, the myth, the legend, the Spaniard. Yeah, by the way, uh, that was my controller dying. By the way, when there's that pause there, so, if you're wondering. But Sesc takes a shot. What a finish! What an incredible finish. Sesc Fabregas has really saved us the last few games. Good play, brilliant from the Spanish man in form. And back-to-back -back games means back-to-back -back goals for Sex Fabregas. <laughs> May have got a little too excited with that. Oh, great, we've conceded. How are you getting it through? Okay, all right. That's, that's, uh, yeah, he just had enough. Um, I had enough of you, Murata. That is obviously the world's best challenge ever. Okay, Ed Nazard, Ed Nazard. Oh, it's Nazard. It's Murata! It's Murata! What a finish! It's Alvaro Murata! Didn't expect the cross to go through, but it was a brilliant one from Eden. And Murata takes what he deserves from the Garden of Eden. Brilliant finish there, and we achieve a goal lead again. So yeah, Murata there. Uh, obviously a very good finish. Not sure why there's any need for the angles, but um, yeah, it was a good finish. Alvaro Murata. Great job, man. And there we go. It's a narrow 2-1 victory over LA Galaxy. Ironically, they were the ones who scored instead of Real Madrid, but... Yeah, this was a tough game. Uh, definitely came out and shined during that second half. And, uh... Yeah, and a good way to end off this episode. Yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and yeah, I shall see you guys later. Peace!